Hello and welcome yet to another character tutorial. We are starting from this page because this is take three and everything I keep doing is going wrong and there's someone pinging me on Facebook and pinging me over left, right and center. Or a page just come out in the way just now as well. Um, because I was trying to delete a Facebook page because all I could do was ding, ding. Anyway, however, welcome to the character tutorial of Ragnar Lothbrok. Now, as I was saying on the previous two takes, um... I am not doing the actor from um, Vikings itself. I can't remember his name. I can't remember his name at all. I've got it here on the right hand side if need be. But I just can't be bothered. We're going for the one that has uh, depicted the the true Viking back way we're now. Uh, Banu should already be out by the time this comes out, but this is literally 108 has literally just been released as I'm recording this. It's just literally moments ago. Um, really happy with the uh, with the update as well. It looks really nice, and they're doing, the team's doing a fantastic job. And it's making me have to reset every time to test out and uh, enjoy enjoy the new techniques and tweaks. So we're going to do a, probably do a playthrough for this one anyway. We're doing Ragnar Lothbrok, uh, the original style. So when Ragnar first came to England, uh, he was noted as two things, uh, well, three things really: his height. He was classed as a giant of a man. All Norse were to the English. They were classed as giants. The English were, you know, they're pretty tall, but the, these Vikings were massive. These were broad. These were strong. These were men who wanted to raid, pillage, rape, kill, take everything they can and come back with all the gold and glory and come back with stories. Now, most people are going to go for this one because this is Ragnar in the TV show's hair. However, the Ragnar we're going for really is not that haircut at all. Um, you're going to be, you know, shocked maybe. That's going to have to be that one, isn't it? There's no, no diversity in what I'm after, if I'm honest. I wanted a braided kind of styled hair. This is my first run through as well. This is, I've never actually done this character. Um, you might be able to tell. I'm going to have no choice. He was more of a, a squared here kind of friend. He didn't have this bow on all the depictions that I've got. I don't really want to do the character. I really don't want to do it. it it'll be easy to do. Would it be easy? Nah, it would be easy. He's got a funny face, hasn't he? Um, <clears throat> I won't say he's got a funny face. But you guys know what I mean. I don't mean it like that. Uh, let's give him the correct fucking beard, first of all. Now, that is going to be the closest we're going to get for the beard that we want. The hair is going to have to be this one. I'm not happy with this hair. Um, just because of this here. I need this to come around here more. Oh, I really need to start. They need to hire more character artists just to to do this part. It could be separate updates then. Um, very frustrating. Oh, ooh, hello, hello. We're almost there with it. No, no, ah, it looks like it's a, it's a no go. That's that's close ish, but it's it's not right. So we're gonna go for this one. He does in the um have this in the depicted photo that I'm looking at, but he has it round the whole of his head. So we're gonna have to go for this one, and we're gonna have to start off with he's got blue eyes, which is great. Um, we're gonna go for his nose first because his nose is very unique looking. I'm just gonna zoom in here a bit, guys. I do apologise. Give me a moment. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cookies, cookies. Blah, blah, blah. So his nose is very much straight. There's no, there's no dip here like here. So we need to get that nose bridge straight out as much as possible. His nose drops down quite a fair bit, which ah, which is pushing that out. That's perfect. You know, you quite like that actually, guys. He's got a very much of a nose there we go definition um he has a few scars on his face as well we'll have to put those on him in a minute uh, nose bridge is up there yeah i need that out nose angle now that's interesting ah that is almost what he looks like on this photo I've got going. 
Uh, he looks like he's got quite a very thick nose. Looks more like a, like a dwarf, eh? Uh, nose size. Is, there we go. Um, nostril size. We're going to give him a bit of an extra here. Let's have a look. Nose looks massive. There we go. Okay, right. Um, that is actually perfect. <laughs> you wouldn't believe this. I'm looking at this nose and I'm looking at that. His nostrils are a little bit higher up. So if we can get the nostril height up. Let's put on high definition quickly. Very much there. Just trying to get that right. It's only because he's growling in the photo. You can see he doesn't look happy. So um, the frown or smile, he does not look like a happy man. He doesn't have that lip thickness. So he is a bad guy, unfortunately, guys, in, in, in the sense for England. Now, how far does his mouth come out? It's about there on the... There on the photo. Bottom lip shape. Let's check that. Ah, it's too too high. Oh, now we're getting there. We need that bottom lip. So, oh, oh, we need that bottom lip. It's too fat. Bottom looks way too fat. Jawline. It's very much dropped in here. With the jaw shape dropped in. His chin's definitely not forward. That thing's fucking dropped in. His chin shape. It's very much hidden in his bed in his beard. Looks like he's got a massive chin. There. And his eyes. His eyes are very, very nasty looking. So his eyes are dropped underneath the, the brow. And his brow rests on top of his eye here. So we need to bring that all the way down by the looks of things. Sure here. That's better. There we go. So we drop in his eyes here because he's got this death stare. Now most people have death stare have like this 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 weird shaped eyebrow. You you'll notice it on people when they can death stare people out. And it's never a straight line. Look at that, there we go. I mean that's actually quite decent. We've got some good to some good tools here. I'm just trying to get where this is going. This is more up here, isn't it? Oh, that's a bit down there. His eye size is a little bit on the smaller side. Okay, so we shrink his eyes a bit. You'll see why on the thumbnail. If you if you look at the thumbnail, um, he's very much beady eye looking kind of guy. Uh, eyelid height just done. Eye depth now. Ha ha. Right. So we need to get this just right. There we 
go. I'm getting there, guys. We just need to age his face, really. Um, say age it. He has a scar literally across here. I don't know if there's any scars that run across there, really. There's that there, but this needs to be more higher up. We need more scars. There's been stuff added here. Don't know where. Something's been added because this, I'm sure this wasn't down here. I'll have to go back. This is on the wrong side. If I can have this on the other side, that's perfect. But we'll go with it anyway. Just because it's it's the closest thing I can get hold of on, on this. Um, eye to eye distance. Now, this is very hard to tell. So I'm going to bring it in a bit. I cement uh, symmetry is fine. Blue is the right color. If you have those glacious blue eyes, supposedly like a death staring one. Um, a face. Now this is one I always like to work on last nowadays. It used to be first. Um, let's face a bit. Bring it down to the. Looks like he's got pretty much not like a peanut head, but very close to it. Face depth. Need. I need that lip shortened. It's so fat. It's not going to let me, is it? I, I really need to thin down that lip a bit more. It's the only thing that's let me down on this. This is really good so far. It's just that bottom lip is too. It's too thick. It's too thick. Um. Face sharpness. Now, if that brings down the mouth a bit, where's that gone? Face sharpness. There we go. Temple whip. And there we go. Face ratio. Ah, right, so he has quite a large forehead. So we need to build more on the emphasis of his forehead. Again, this is very much like the Odin one. I think they used to do a lot of headbutting back in those days, maybe. I, I don't know. We're getting there now, guys. We're getting there. size and a shape and there we have it that looks majority like the um, thumbnail apart from that I'm not happy with the lip but there's not much I can do about that um, this is the Ragnar Lufbrook uh, style from the original what he actually looked like I could give oh, what's his name it's like Tyler or whatever his name is, I don't bloody know anymore. I used to know his bloody name. What's his name? Travis, whatever it is, isn't it? Travis or Tyler or whatever it is. Yeah, Travis, there it is. Travis Dimmel, Dremel, whatever. Um, yeah, I'm not going to give him a try. This doesn't have enough characteristics. But, however, this is close. The beard's not too far off. So, choosing his family, we all know that he's going to have to have one-handed. Uh, it didn't really... Uh, I'd have to find out about horses, but he was more of a boatsman. Uh, and very, very strong fit kind of guy. Um, might do urban artisans for this guy. In the, in the TV show, it says he's a free farmer and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure this would probably be more suited for him. And the leadership, he was a natural born leader. He really was. Um, just trying to see what else there is before I do anything else. Yeah, leadership skills. See, you can do the bloody thin lips there. Um. That's probably going to be the best one for him. Yeah, we're going to go with Ali Gangs just to get that um, one-handed up. 
So as I... <laughs> it's just a baby's head every time on top of an adult's body. Uh, we're gonna maybe have to um, train to the inventory might be the best one here. Not really happy with him doing anything much else with that. Uh, we need to get him some endurance here, guys. It's got to be the best one for him. Defeat an enemy in battle. Um, you survived the siege. Ooh, you had a famous escapade. Maybe it was a love affair. Maybe you cheated at dice. Or maybe you just uh, just chose your words poorly when drinking a dang uh, dangerous crowd. Anyway, you got into all kinds of trouble. Uh, which are only quick tongue or quick feet to get out alive. Oh, I'm gonna have to go for that one. And this is the last one. So subdued is gonna be the best one for me. I need endurance up, so I'm gonna have to manually when I level him up. Oh wow! In close, he looks absolutely almost fucking like him. Wow! With his death stare. Look at that death stare. Now, I'm really happy with that death stare. I really am. Um, oh, my God. But you see the thumbnail. If you have, Well, you'll see the thumbnail before you click on it. But, oh, I'm really happy with that. Um, even there, look at that. Yeah, subdued the raider. And there we have. We have Ragnar. Actually, there's a weird way of spelling it. The proper Norse. Uh, the Norse way. A, a proper way of spelling his name. Just gotta think of how you spell it. Uh, it's not gonna, it's not gonna show you. Oh, I can't spell it the the way um, where it's supposed to be done. But there you go. Ragnar Lothbrok with that fucking death stare is just uh, brilliant for me. It really is. I'm gonna save the image uh, after this. But thank you ever so much, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you enjoyed it, please give me a like and subscribe. It, it does help. I mean, I've only got 49 people. But, you know, 49 people, I'm, I'm very, very, very humble and gracious to. You know, I, I really do mean it. It's great that there's some people commenting all over and sending me uh, PMs and DMs and stuff like that, I should say. Uh, same thank you and stuff like this. It, it's getting there. You know, It's reaching out to some people. It's not reaching out to everyone, but, you know, I'm, I'm happy enough that some people are seeing this and, and seeing my work, so um, why can't I? Oh, can you not? You can't do it, can you? Like that? You have to do it as this, yeah. You can't put a space bar in. Maybe you can't underscore. No, you can't underscore. There you go. There's another tip from me. You can't space bar, so you'd have to call him Ragnar. Um, so thank you guys, and I hope you enjoyed, and I shall see you again on our next video. Take it easy, guys.